You played a lot of minutes tonight and almost had a 2020 game. Did you, were you feeling pretty spry out there? Or was it just good old um, minutes? Yeah, just trying, to, just trying to finish the season the right way, you know. Um, getting out there, trying to play hard, uh, you know, trying to end on the high note. Is that your way of just, you know, trying to be a leader on this team, lead by example? Coach talked about, you know, this growing pains kind of for the bench in this game. Yeah, absolutely. Um, you know, because for us right now, it's about setting the tone for next year. Uh, you know, we want to finish the season on a high note. Uh, you know, we want to continue to work on a lot of the things that, you know, we've been working on since, you know, Earl took over. So, uh, you know, it's very important down the stretch that, you know, we continue to, you know, play these games out because, you know, a lot of the younger players are getting, you know, some learning experience. And not only that, but we're getting, you know, uh, opportunity to play with, you know, different lineups and things that, you know, we can grow better, you know, we can grow it. A lot of streaks, though. You guys had the early lead. They got it in the second. And yeah. You came back, you know, what, four in the third there. Yeah, I mean, we're competing, you know. Uh, we're going to compete. You know, we're going to compete every time we step on the floor. Uh, you know, clearly we know we we, we, we got a battle. You know, after a battle, we got a lot of injuries. Um, so, you know, we got to get out there and fight. Um, you know, we're going to continue to do that. For all the struggles you had early in the season with new parts and everything, are you pleased personally that your production's kind of on level with where it's always been? Um, you know, I mean, I know I can play. Uh, you know, of course, you know, when you, when you put up good numbers, then, you know, everybody feels like, you know, you, you're doing what you're capable of doing. But, you know, I know I can play. I just, for me, this year has been a lot about, you know, trying to, Bring along guys, and you know, and, and you know, and then trying to find my way, you know, with different lineups and injuries and all that kind of stuff. It's just, it's, it's been, it's been a year, um, you know. So I, I was, I was never concerned, you know, whether or not I can put up those type of numbers. For me, it's about winning, you know, um, and that's that's the biggest step. Alex struggled with his shot tonight. How important is it to kind of stay in his ear and keep building him up even as he battles to experience? Yeah, he has a bright future ahead of him, um, you know, and, and you're going to have some, some, some nights where it's going to be tough, you know, but, um, you know, as, as he and, you know, the rest of us continue to grow, we'll, we'll understand that, you know, it doesn't matter, um, you know, when you're off uh, offensively, you know, there's other things that you can do out there, you know, defensively rebounding and, and you know, making other players better. Uh, he and, and Book are going to see a lot of that throughout their career. You know, they're going to have nights where, you know, they're doubling and, and, you know, force them into tough things, and you just you make others around you better. So it's part of the learning curve. So you guys are, um, have lost all the games to the Jazz this year. They're a particularly tough matchup for you guys. Just with all the switching and all their base, you can play on the perimeter. Is that especially tough for you and Alex? Um, you know, I, honestly, I mean, you know, I had to go look at it after. I didn't know that we lost to him all four games, honestly. Uh, but, you know, they're, 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 they're fighting for, uh, you know, their playoff hopes right now. And, um, you know, they got a young team. So, clearly that's going to be a team that, you know, we're going to have to face in the future, um, you know, and get past. Um, yeah. Is this one of the hardest stages? Because you, you guys had some momentum there when they're starting to do some victory results. But now... It's a six-game losing streak. You can look at the calendar real easy and see it's almost <clears throat> over. Yeah, no. Um, you know, for me, I'm not I'm not even getting caught up with that, honestly. It's, it's about the growth. Uh, it's about the growth of these young players. And, and even me getting used to used to a lot of, you know, it's, it's important that I continue to, to build a rapport with Book and, you know, and Alex and, you know, you know some of the young guys because we got to come back. We're going to lean on those guys, you know, next year. Um, so, you know, it's very important down the stretch. Who cares, you know? Um, who cares? Of course, you want to get out there and win, but who cares how many games are left? It's about going out there and approaching them and getting better and getting better and getting better. Um, to me, that's the biggest, biggest focus.